Hi, I'm Elise Holman and you're watching Sky News Sport on YouTube. Well, it's been a big week in sport, emotional news for Jim Steins and the AFL, more off-field troubles in rugby league and union, and of course, Leighton Hewitt's stunning surge at Wimbledon. But on the lighter side, here's our top 10 performers of the week. There's plenty of things to fight about in dirt racing. The size of your bike, for example. And there was certainly no love lost between this pair. One grandma proved this week that your 75th birthday doesn't need to be about candles and cake. She jumped out of a plane. And it was just, as I'm getting older, I thought I've got to do some more things. Otherwise you stagnate. When you think Opto Push, you might think Opto Mum. But not for these guys. It's a new underwater form of hand hockey taking Swansea by storm. An egg-centric band of folk have been taking part in the World Egg Throwing Championships. An international field was scrambling to become the biggest tossers, a sport only for the most hard-boiled of competitors. The Barmy Army is again taking to the airways and this time taking aim at Ricky Ponting. An anthem of a different kind for the Springbok, but if people thought the lyrics along the bottom of the screen might help us all, think again. It's been a week for the bad boys across all footy codes. First it was Barry, then Lottie Takiri and Brett Seymour both managed to lose a lot of money along with their contracts. It was sweet 16th for the Socceroos who attained their highest ever FIFA ranking. On the back of World Cup qualification, Australia leaped from the lines of Portugal and Uruguay. Valentino Rossi comes in at two after recording his 100th Grand Prix victory. The eight-time world champion was unstoppable at Assen. Valentino Rossi, the 30-year-old Italian, wins his 100th Grand Prix victory. But Leighton Hewitt takes out top spot for his quarter-final surge at Wimbledon. The Aussies put on a typical five-set thriller against Andy Roddick, this time falling just short. This is an epic. This goes down as the best match this year at Wimbledon. And for all the latest in sport, don't forget to tune into Sportsline, 9.30am and 10.30pm Eastern, seven days a week on Foxtel and Ozstar.